EastEnders' latest update. Star Heather Peace opens up over real-life friendship with co-star. Phil discovers George killed his wife in stunning revelation. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. EastEnders star Heather Peace opens up over real-life friendship with co-star. EastEnders spoilers follow. EastEnders star Heather Peace has opened up over her real-life friendship with co-star Balvinder Sopal. The pair play lovers Eve Unwin and Suki Kaur Panazar, respectively, in the BBC One soap, and are currently involved in a fraught storyline where Suki's son Vinny is blackmailing her to stay away from Eve. Speaking to Digital Spy and other media about the storyline, Heather revealed that she has a very close friendship with Balvinder, away from the world of Walford. We are very good communicators, she said. The lines of communication have been open from the beginning. Because as soon as you have to do anything intimate, you have to be able to talk, and you have to know that each other feels comfortable in whatever situation. When we do all those things, we'll get together and discuss it, we'll get together and work out. Anything that is intimate, we choreograph within an inch of its life. As soon as people are sort of chewing each other's faces off, with a one of a better word, it's gone. The actress also credited some of the power of their storyline to the real-life bond she has formed with Balvinder since their storyline began several months ago. The longer you work together as well, there's things that you just become more comfortable with. It's like a dance routine where you know where each other is going to go, Heather said. The longer we do this, the easier it gets and there's a massive trust between us. She's also a really great mate. We have a lot of laughs, but in between we take it really seriously as we realize that we've been given a story that means a lot to a really marginalized part of the population. Heather went on, we also want to play the love story to change hearts and minds of people like, probably my Catholic grandmother who would be like, ooh. The love element of that and the magnetisms of two people they're just souls coming together, and it's really, really important. It's just two people who can't not be together. We're coming at it from the same point. The communication's always open, and we find it really easy to talk it through. We are coming from the same point. The line of communication is open. We're just really good pals. Ball is down south, and I'm down south, and we'll go and get a cup of tea. She doesn't drink wine, and so I have a cup of tea with her instead. We hang out. Fans seem to be constantly rooting for Eve and Suki to end up together, even if they've suffered another setback following Suki possibly being pushed down the stairs at her home. The phone blew up last week after that smoking hot scene came out. You know the slightly racy scene, she recalled. It has touched a lot of people. With the reaction from the fans, you realize that you're hopefully hitting the right beats. It means a lot to people. EastEnders spoilers. Phil discovers George killed his wife in stunning revelation. There's a mystery surrounding the Knight family, who've recently moved in to EastEnders iconic Queen Vic pub. It centers around Anna Molly Rainford, and Gina Francesca Henry, his mum Rose, George, Colin Salmon, ex-wife. In recent episodes, Gina confronted her dad after she heard that he proposed to Elaine, Harriet Thorpe, and she accepted. George wanted to know why Gina had become upset and fled from the bar at the news, and she told him that it was because he never mentions their mom. Rose abandoned the family nine years ago, and they've heard nothing from her since. Despite this, Gina revealed that she and sister Anna talk about Rose all the time, but George never mentions her. While George made it clear that Elaine wasn't intending to replace their mum, he also insisted that life can't stand still forever, and he was determined to move on. One person who isn't going to move on easily from this is Linda Carter, Kelly Bright, who's been suspicious of George from the outset. She decides to talk to Phil, Steve McFadden, about the mysterious Rose, and he agrees to do some digging, with Callum, Tummy Clay's help. 
Even with the resources of the police at his disposal, Callum comes up with nothing useful as George's record seems fairly clean. It's when he tries searching for Rose on the police computer system that the mystery really deepens as all access is denied. This news convinces Linda that her instinct about George is right. Phil continues to try to find out what could have happened to Rose by asking George directly. George fobs him off and insists he isn't hiding anything and Linda has got him wrong. Colin Salmon told us, some people think he killed Rose, so it's been nine years of mystery and heartache on top of suspicion and misunderstanding. It's hard if you are a member of a family and your spouse has gone missing, everyone thinks they know what's going on. Despite this, Phil refuses to give up and gets Richie, Cyan Weber, to help. Armed with whatever information she can provide, he's soon accusing George of not being straight with him. What has Richie discovered? Could Rose actually be dead? Or is there another explanation? Expect huge revelations in a special episode set to air soon, when we'll finally discover what happened to Rose. Thanks for watching these videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.